meteorologist Ryan Trushlett. This morning, there are no threat level changes as a storm system brings rainfall to the Ohio Valley. The southern plains are temporarily clear and cool today as the disturbance has moved east of the region. However, another low will cross the zone Friday and Saturday, bringing three quarters to one and a half inches to eastern Oklahoma and Texas with lesser totals north. Above average temperatures and drier weather follow as a ridge develops over the southeast next week. DEFCON 4. The Mississippi Delta recorded one to two inches of rainfall generally in the last three days, bringing a dry month to an end. Look for another rain chance totaling another half inch to one inch to move through over the weekend, ahead of much warmer than average temperatures next week, driven by southeastern U.S. high pressure. DEFCON 4. The Midwest is seeing moderate to heavy rainfall move through central and eastern sections today. Look for rain totals of up to an additional inch through tomorrow before a front clears the zone. Only a very modest freeze is expected north and west on Friday morning, with mild temperatures at long range, and another rain chance late in the weekend tallying around half an inch. DEFCON 3. In South America, satellite imagery shows that scattered storms continue over central Brazil. This pattern will continue this week, with above normal seven-day accumulation centered on Mato Grosso do Sol and Minas Gerais as a typical El Nino pattern takes hold. DEFCON 3. Now you're in the loop for October 28th. Keep watching the skies.